Evan, turmoil in town as Intel is getting ready to move in next door. The city of Johnstown is getting ready for the tech giant's arrival, but it will soon not have a mayor or city council president. Last week, voters overwhelmingly decided to recall them in a special election. NBC4's Eric Halpern attended tonight's city council meeting, the last with the now ousted leaders. Some who are here don't think the mayor and city council president should have even been a part of tonight's meeting. If they don't resign beforehand, they'll officially be out of office when the election results are certified next week. You want him to remove me? Yes. yes. Be quiet. Yes. Three me. Your three minutes are up. I'm not going. We're asking for him. Oh, am I? Yes, yes. you need to go. Oh, I'm not going. Heated moments at Tuesday night's Johnstown City Council meeting, the first since Mayor Chip Dutcher and Council President Marvin Block were recalled in a special election. This good old boy ideology will not be tolerated and needs to stop tonight. During public comment, three speakers, including the city's former finance director and police chief, making it known they're not happy with leadership in the city. You had the opportunity in February to apologize and resign in dignified manner. Instead, there you sit, and it's despicable. We, the people, last Tuesday stood up and sent a message, a very powerful message. We fired the mayor and the president and council. These two should not be in that executive session. They shouldn't make any choices tonight. More than 70% of voters voted to recall Dutcher. More than 75% voted to recall Block. They will no longer be in office once the special election results are certified next week. Until the vote is certified, they had every right to be here and, and sit in their positions. The remaining members will appoint residents to the soon to be open seats. City Manager Jack Liggett says council will likely ask for applications at its next meeting. Liggett is calling for the community to come together as the city gets ready for Intel moving in next door in New Albany. The ceremonial groundbreaking with President Biden is Friday. We need to come together and move forward as a unified city and prepare for the growth and the good things that can come out of Intel coming to our community. Mayor Dutcher declined to comment after tonight's meeting. Council President Block also declined. He asked council to consider forming a committee with residents to, quote, start the healing process for Johnstown. Local for you in Johnstown, I'm Eric Halperin, NBC4.